Francine Overhog Princess, and welcome to another Vera Bradley haul. This haul is part three of my aerial floral. This is the haul um, of the three items that were sold out right away online, and I had ordered them via phone order for a locate, they call it, and um, thankfully the order came through. So yay, it arrived today. Um, just to reiterate the point though, if ever things show out sold out online, they might be available if you call a store. They may either have it in stock or they can locate it in the system of stores and find it that way and place an order where it'll either come from the warehouse or come from that other store that has it and get it to you. I've been very fortunate over the years to collect up those items that I thought I had missed and it showed sold out. So it is a very, very viable option. You can call any retail store and they can look it up for you and make that order for you. Um, in this case, um, I think a lot of people were lucky because they did do a restock. Even as late as yesterday afternoon, all these items were restocked. Um, I think they've sold out again. I don't know for sure. I stopped looking because if I stop looking, I stop buying. But this was all part of my initial order on day one. So the first item is the clamshell cosmetic. And this uh, is it's a clamshell. I like the clamshells. I have them now in several different sizes and shapes. Um, the outlet version, the factory style, is now... Not quite a clamshell, but it's a little more curved top zipper and the clamshell shape, kind of like that. So it's smaller at the bottom and wider, and then bigger at the bottom and narrower. So it's kind of that, um, remember those little push pops we had as kids that had that double triangle thing? Anyway, um, so this is quilted, and so it is padded, actually. This is more padding than it seems like on regular quilting because it's just the way it is, I guess. Um, it does have those gigantic tags, I don't know why. Um, but I got lucky, and this one I have an aerial on the front. It's unfortunate that her face is right in the middle of the stitching. It's not worth undoing that stitching to free up her face. But I may consider trying that at a later date. We shall see. Probably not, because right on the other side I have almost perfect placement. <laughs> She's a little high, but she's not cut off. Her entire head is there. The seam goes through her hair, but she is right there in the front center section. So that's good. I do have Sebastian on here twice and some lovely florals. So overall, it's pretty balanced, even on this side where it's going right through her. Unfortunately, Flounder's not anywhere on the main thing, but he is on the bottom. So uh, but we got the whole family, the main characters anyways. Inside of this is plastic lined. It has a mesh elastic pocket on one side and it has the aerial floral ditzy pattern on the inside which does have um, all the fishies. It has Sebastian and flounder but does not have the mermaid but there you go. Then I got the treasure chest. Um, this is super cute. Um, I like the color. It is a different kind of quilting if you haven't seen it the quilting is little clamshell quilting so kind of like this but in a smaller size you can see it better right there you can kind of see the clamshells so that's really kind of an, a, a cute idea going forward and then it has of course this embroidered shell on top and flounder and flowers up here um, so this I think would be even cooler if it had a little top handle here and I may I don't know I may so because it would be perfect, just sew it on the sides and you have just a little top handle so you kind of carry it around like this or can reach into a bag and grab it and hold it. Um, that's just me, but I maybe, I might do that. Here's another look at the quilting. You can kind of see the seashell framework there. All right, but this is a zipper and, and then just an open section. This is soft lined, so it's like a velvety feel, like a microfiber, uh, the super fine like jewelry cloth, if you will. So I you know it's a treasure chest, meant to hold your treasures, your jewels and whatnot, I suppose. Um, yeah, I think it's really cool. I may or may not use it for that exactly. Probably not, I'll probably put other trinkets in there, use it as a tech case, um, whatnot. Obviously not intended for wet items. It is a soft lined thing, dry, dry weave. Um, anyway, I, I think it's really cool. The only other thing I will say about it is like lug when they have zippers like this, they have a little tab to hold on to to close it. This has nothing. So you kind of, it's a little bit awkward to, like you have to put tension on it to get it to zip. So you kind of have to grab a hold of it 
to zip it and unzip it. It's just a little bit awkward. It works just fine, the zipper's smooth, there's nothing wrong with the zipper, it's just, there's nothing to hold to get the tension. But anyways, it's a cute little thing, really novel little concept. Looks super adorable just sitting somewhere so it can be out, um, like a little kid's jewelry box or something, that would be kind of fun. Uh, I'm not a kid, but I'm a kid heart, and I will use it for other things. And the last item I got is the Ariel Throw. There are two throws, and basically one of them is a floral and one of them is a ditzy, I think. But I like the Ariel one. I like the ditzy fine, but I really am all about the full picture. So here it is. I can't see you, but there's the top part. Eh, carp play the harp. <laughs> and then Ariel and flounder. And what do we have on the bottom? More flowers and fishes. There you go. Yeah. So I love my purples and teals. This is straight up my alley for sure. As far as the thickness and softness of it, I think it definitely is in, it's on the softer side for the Vera throws for sure. Um, obviously I can't speak to durability. I just got it, but it is super soft. It is, I don't know if it's technically a plush throw. Yeah, I, I took the tag off, it's on the ribbon, but um, it is soft. They are thin, but it is the normal, you know, they're thin but soft. Yeah, I love them. Super cozy, soft. I, I do like the softness. Anyways, that's it for this haul. Just three items. The three items that I was missing. There are things in my cart <laughs> that I'm trying to not buy because I'm supposed to be going on a cruise. But another video coming right up. Bye for now.